Hello trainers, Ganeto here and today we're diving together into Open Master League. It definitely has been a while since the last time we did that, so today I'm returning into this open balanced meta, by the way, with my top 4 team recommendations on ABB style. Uh, we're gonna have a Groudon up on the lead of the first team showcase with double seal at the back. So Groudon is an amazing Pokemon, especially with Matchot. I really like how easy it can get to Earthquake and Fire Punch, especially Fire Punch, because it's gonna be a very cheap move to use. Definitely one of the best moves that you can use in order to grab some seals and then nook down with your earthquakes. Uh, at the back, we have a double steel backline uh, with a Dialga and Temel Metal. You're gonna see Dialga a lot on this video, and there is a reason behind that because uh, Dialga is gonna be an amazing Pokemon for Master League, basically the king of the meta. Everything is rotating around Dialga, to be honest. Uh, as a safe switch, we got Mel Metal, which is gonna be used here with Flash Cannon just for a little bit of spice but also because a lot of people tend to use Zerneas, Zacian and uh, Tokigis so that uh, with a pure flash cannon we, you can destroy down that threat with this. Uh, as a core breaker though you can see that we have ho -Oh here so perhaps you want to use a rock slide uh, over flash cannon or even super power because super power is definitely gonna help you a lot against the Alga which is as we have already said the king of the meta and pretty much everywhere. ho -Oh is gonna be able to go pretty well not only against Metal though, but also against the Dialga because it has access to Earthquake, and of course against uh, uh, Groudon because Groudon is struggling a lot against those flyers. So, if you do not like the flyers, just be sure that you're running Dragon Tail because that move can help you not only against uh, flyers but also against other dragon types, something like uh, a Garchomp or even something like a Zekrom or a Palkia. We continue now into the next one with a Melmetal up on the lead, followed up by Double Dragon at the back. So, Melmetal is an amazing Pokemon. Once again, I'm using Flash Cannon, but feel free to rotate your moveset to your will. I like Flash Cannon, as I have already said, for certain matchups, but of course, uh, if your opponent is having a Dialga up against your lead Pokemon here, well, uh, they most probably will be able to switch out to their safe switch, so that's why I like Melmetal with Flash Cannon. Nobody expects it, and uh, of course, Super Power and Rock Slide is gonna be the standard moveset for this Pokemon. At the back, we have a Double Dragon with a uh, Dragonite being the closer here because it has access to an amazing moveset and now this season with super power it is gonna be able to do a lot of work against the enemy. Safe switch of the team is gonna be the Giratina on its origin form but I really think that altered form is gonna be an amazing Pokemon as well. On its origin form you're kinda uh, getting walled against certain threats something like a dark type or a normal type but other than that Giratina can still hold on against those uh, uh, fairy types so that's why you are seeing it on the safe switch option. Let's say you're encountering up on the lead a Garchomp, safe switch to your Giratina, even if they bring into the fight something like a Zacian or a Tokigis, you still have a Wincon, which is pretty nice for the Giratina. Feel free to uh, replace that ominous wind with a Dragon Pulse for some extra spice or some extra coverage against the normal type, something like a Snorlax that you might find along the way. Core breaker of this line is gonna be the Garchomp, as we have already said, uh, because this Pokemon can go pretty well against uh, Melmetal and has Outrage, which can definitely threat the back line. However, it is gonna be not that much of a threat because every single Pokemon from this list can still somehow uh, do severe damage to Garchomp, and with a little bit of synergy, you can overcome even that obstacle. Hopping now into the next team showcase and we're having a Mewtwo with Double Dragon. Mewtwo is an amazing Pokemon, especially upon the lead, he can definitely surprise the enemy. Feel free to use Psy Strike and uh, that Psycho Cut as your fast attack, because those two are gonna be your main way to go pretty much against anything. Other than that, you can use whatever you want, just be weird on your moveset here, because you can definitely surprise the enemy. Even against uh, Yveltal here, you're gonna see that a pure Ice Beam or Thunderbolt can help a lot and of course Thunderbolt can help you against those uh, Kyogres that are gonna be not that much uh, available to everyone for, with Excels on Open Master League but still are gonna be a severe threat for that Mewtwo. Uh, at the back we have the Garchom and the Dialga and those two Pokemon can handle pretty much the meta uh, so you're gonna see a lot of work being done from your Dialga and of course your Garchom. Garchom is gonna be able to nuke down your enemies with Matsu 
Shot, Earth Power and uh, Outrage and of course it can carry the move uh, Santum which gonna be ideal for some really nice baits and uh, debuffing the enemy with ease. As a safe switch we have here the Dialga because it has an amazing moveset, an amazing typing and to be honest it covers pretty much everything even against its counters it can definitely take out a shield out of them. Core breaker of this line, Yaveltal, you're gonna see that its dark typing really helps against Mewtwo and has also access to Focus Blast which can destroy down that uh, Dialga. Against uh, Garchomp it is kinda weird to say who can win, it's all about who can reach to those charge attacks faster and to be honest they reach about at the same time so if you have a little bit of energy ahead you might be able to overcome even the obstacle of Yaveltal. Hopping into the final one trainers and we're having a Giratina double steal here. Giratina is an amazing Pokemon overall to use and you are not gonna regret your time using Giratina Origin on any team of yours because you're gonna see that uh, Giratina with Shadow Ball can absolutely destroy down anything and of course some severe counters might exist on the face of Yaveltal and Snorlax but here is where the backline can really come in and can be used towards your advantage. As a safe switch we got the Dialga which is gonna be an amazing Pokemon overall, you already seen it uh, with uh, my other two teams on this video and it performs pretty much uh, amazingly good, uh, so I really recommend this Pokemon to use and of course it's gonna be the king of the meta, everything rotates around it so there is a reason why we're seeing so often that uh, Dialga. As a closer I have uh, Excadrill here because it can be used pretty much with uh, its power to destroy down anything and one of the best core breakers on the game I believe for Master League and uh, you're gonna see that the Rock Slide and Drill Run are both gonna be pretty good moves to cover everything on the current meta of Open Master League. Uh, core breaker of this line is gonna be Dragonite because Dragonite can work pretty well with its dragon moves against Giratina and has super power which can set the backline but still kind of a glassy option for Master League and can get outclassed by the Drango Breath of uh, Dialga if shields are up. So that's all trainers, thank you for watching, thank you for staying till the end, just be sure to leave a huge like before you go, subscribe to the channel if you already haven't and I hope to see you all into the next one, take care trainers!